Hello there, good morning to you. On today's show, we are paying homage to that classic wardrobe staple with our National Little Black Dress Day. And of course, it'll be the moment of truth for our Little Black Dress dieters. Find out if all their hard work has paid off. Have they really dropped a dress size in time for Christmas? We'll see you in a few minutes. National Little Black Dress Day. We have declared it so. And of course, it's the moment of truth for our dieters. This was um, a month ago, do you remember, when they couldn't? Carol Machen joins me now from One Workplace, where the party, hopefully, is in full swing. Carol, where are you, first of all? Good morning, Lorraine. I'm here in Manchester. It's official. Lorraine, as you can see, I've got my little black dress on, but wait until you see these ladies! <laughs> Fantastic. Listen, thank you, love. I really, I'd really, i love to see Martina doing it. She's such a legend and such a warrior. But I think, do you know what, though? If David Van Day wins, it sort of blows apart all the reality show stuff, doesn't it? Because doesn't it, though? Because he's so playing a game. He's, he's just gone so in there playing, playing a game. But then that's what it is. It's so obvious. It could really be the tipping point for the show, I think, because, as like I say, his tactics have been so... In here for a chat. She's lovely. Um, Thank you, Angel. Cheers, doll. Thank you. We'll be watching, obviously, on Friday for the big final. Right, we're going to have a quick break now. Still to come this morning, fashion stylist Louise Rowe is on hand. Hello, welcome back. Now, still to come, you might have woken up to snow. Where we showed you our top ten little black dresses. But what do you wear underneath to make sure you look your best? Louise Rowe is here with a selection of underwear for all shapes and sizes. Because it's quite difficult to get it right, isn't it? It is, but mm. it's so important. It can make so much difference.